Hello, you are welcome. How to solve for x in this nice square problem? Here from here, solution from what is given is the square root of 2x plus 3 plus square root of x minus 2 equals to 4. From here, let's take this square root of x minus 2 to this side. Here we are left with square root of 2x plus 3 equals to 4 minus square root of x minus 2. Then from here, let's square both sides of this. And this will give us into bracket root 2x plus 3 square and plus here. Excuse me, here we have equal to also into bracket 4 minus root x minus 2 all square. Now, from here, we can use the power square when we have a minus b all square. So here, this will give us a square minus 2ab plus b square. And uh, this equation then becomes square as cancel square root here, and we have 2x plus 3 left, which is equal to here, follow this pattern, which will give us 4 square, a minus 2 times 4 times square root of x minus 2, then times here we have square root of x minus 2 square. Then next from here, this becomes 2x plus 3, now equals to 4 square here, 4 times 4, that's 16, then minus 2 times 4 here, that's 8, then root x minus 2, then plus this, this is plus, then plus here, square also can be square root. Then we have x minus 2. Then here, on this side, this is 16 minus 2. That's 14. So this becomes 2x plus 3. Now equals to here, we have 14. Then plus x. Then minus 8. Multiply by root x minus 2. Then let's take... 14 and the x to this side, so this becomes 2x minus x, then we have plus 3, plus 3 minus 14 from here, which is equal to, here we left with minus 8, root x minus 2, then from here, this will become, 2x minus x, that's x, then 3 minus 14, that's minus 11, now equals to minus 8, then times square root of x minus 2. Then from here, let's square both sides of here, so this becomes x minus 11 square, then equals to minus 8 times root x minus 2, then also square here. Then the square on this side also becomes x square minus 2 times x times 11, that's minus 22x, then plus 11 square here, that's 121, now equals to here, minus 8 square, then root x minus 2 square. Then this becomes x square minus 22x plus 121 now equals to here minus square is plus 8 square 8 times 8 that's 64 then multiply by here square cancel square root and we are left with x minus 2 here and also when we open this bracket this gives us x square minus 22x then plus 121, now equals to 64x, then minus here, 64 times 2, give us 128.
Then let's bring everything to one side to form a quadratic equation here. And uh, this will become x squared minus here minus 22x here. Then when we take this here minus 64x, then we have plus 121 here. Then when minus 128 comes, it will become plus 128, which is now equal to 0. Then this gives us x squared. Then this becomes minus 86 x then plus 249 now equals to 0 then from here here we can solve this equation by factorizing we have the product here which is 249 and we have the sum which is minus 86 here the product of minus 3 then minus 83 will give us plus 243 and here when we sum it minus 3 plus minus 83 will also give us minus 86 and this equation can now be written as x squared minus 3x minus 83x then plus 249 now equals to 0 from here then in the next steps, we can group this together, 2, 2 from here, and this gives us x common here, into bracket here, we have x left, then minus 3 left here, then minus here, 83 common, we also have x left here, then minus 3, which is equal to 0 from here, then x minus 3 common, so we factor that out, we have x minus 3, then what is left here is x then minus 83 equals to 0 then from here is either x minus 3 equals to 0 or we have x minus 83 equals to 0 then here we have x equals to 3 and on this side we have x equals to 83 now let's check on what is given to confirm which one satisfy the equation so we have square root of 2x plus 3 plus square root of x minus 2 equals to 4 now for x equals to 3a when we substitute 3a so we have square root of 2 times 3 plus 3 then plus square root of 3 minus 2 is this equals to 4 on this side then from here we have 2 times 3 here that's 6 then plus 3 that's 9 so we have root 9 plus here 3 minus 2 that's 1 root 1 is this equals to 4 then here root 9 is 3 and root 1 is 1, this is equal to 4, and here 3 plus 1 is 4, which is equal to 4. So here we have the left hand side equals to right hand side, and here s, s equals to 3 satisfies this given problem. Now for x equals to 83, substituting that into what is given, this gives us square root of 2 times 83 plus 3 then plus square root of 83 minus 2 is this equal to 4 on this side then from here we have 2 times 83 that gives us 166 then plus 3 that gives us 169 then plus here 83 minus 2 we have square root of 81 is the same thing as 4 on this side then square root of 169 here we have 13 then plus square root of 81 we have 9 and is this equals to 4 on this side then from here this gives us 
16 plus 9, that's 22, which is not equals to 4. So here, 83 is an extraneous solution, is not satisfying this given problem. So the solution to this problem is S. X equals to 3. So thank you for watching. Don't forget this step. Subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification bell. Share this video and put your comment. Thank you. See you next class. And bye for now.